Hi, my name is Christina and I am from Texas and this is the end of our 47 day challenge and so I just wanted to share a little bit about my experience with the challenge and wanted to um, let you guys know that at first um, it was an overwhelming process. 47 days seemed like a long time to give up certain things, uh, certain food items and stuff like that, that I was going to have to give up. And, um, but it really wasn't, I mean, it, it, at the end of the day, it really wasn't that hard. It's, it, it's just a, you know, change in your habits and it's a change in your lifestyle. And even though I wasn't there in Scottsdale with Jeremy and the, he sends us videos every day and he tells us how to do it and he tells us what to do every day and he, he's inspirational and and I felt like he was talking to me half the time on the video. So um, it really hits home with you and it really resonates and you learn so much from it. And so I learned so much about the macros and the healthy eating habits. And, and I'd have to say, starting out, I was a little skeptical. So even though I have already been gluten free for many years um, due to a food allergy and I couldn't eat the foods with the gluten in it. And a lot of this is very clean eating, so it doesn't have those things in it, which is perfect for me. I'm like, oh, you know, this should be, there's not really a thing I have to give up. Well, I did learn that, um, you know, chocolate is gluten free and wine is gluten free. And those were a lot of the things I was eating um, and that I did give those up and, and it really wasn't that bad. I mean, it was doable and I did it and it was, um, it was great. I've lost eight inches and 10 pounds in 47 days. So that's incredible. Um, that's huge actually for, you know, someone. And um, it was great. It was so much fun. It was a great process. And you, you have your up days, you have your down days, good days, bad days. And as Jeremy says, you just kind of, it, it, it's okay. And you just pick up and you just keep going. And that's what you do. And you just continue every day and you take the next step forward. Um, so I learned so much and I'm so thankful for the process. It has really opened my eyes to um, the nutrition side and I've learned that you cannot out train a, a bad eating habit. Um, so the eating habits are so important, um, especially if you have an injury, which I had, um, and you can't work out. If you've got the eating habits in place and you've got the new, good nutrition plan in place, um, it makes up for that, and it and it really makes a huge difference. Um, I lost a lot of weight without the exercise, you know, at first, and then adding exercise into it and stuff just makes it that much better. It, it's just so much better. Um, I I highly recommend doing this. It is an investment, but you know what? It's it's an investment in yourself, and it's an investment in becoming a better person all around, and. You just, um, you have to trust the process. And Jeremy will tell me that, tell you, just trust the process and, and it does work and you really can't screw it up if you do what he tells you to do. Um, invest in yourself, you know, you can't do any better than that.